Hello, nice I'm to meet Mike. you. I'm Mike, this is John. Nice to meet you, Becky. Nice to meet you. Ignore, ignore, nice to meet you. ignore most of the stuff he says. So we've got Bryn, he's our old male, at about 15. So Bryn's 15, is he going to like an awkward teenage patch? I mean, he's probably doing his GCSEs next year. Yeah. If John jumped in fully clothed, yeah. would it tear him to shreds within seconds? Yes. If I jumped in naked, would it tear me to shreds within seconds? Maybe a bit of a hesitation. But yeah, yeah, there you, might be some. certainly look more frightening. <laughs> I've got another, what I think is an important question. This would be a good question. If there was such a thing as a really docile lion or a tiger, and you had a saddle that fitted it, would you put your seven-year-old nephew on it? To attract customers to the zoo? No. Great answer. And that's why you're a professional, and I'm not. If you dropped a tiger from a second-story window, mm. would it land on its feet? Because I know cats do, I know that for that's a fact. That's true, no, that is true. Nine lives and all that. I've never tried, I don't know. If you are watching, please do not drop a tiger or a cat from a second-story window. No, no type of animal from a window, really. No animals, not fish, nothing. Not even vegetation, it's just not right. Just put, well, put the, put the other stuff in the bin, but mm. the cats and, the, and the, the lions and tigers, just mm. leave them alone. And I was going to ask another question. This would be on. good. Hang on. Hang on. It's gone. No, Sorry. it's gone. Thanks, Joe. <laughs>